Okay, hello, Cancers. How you doing? This is Keep It Classy. You guys, I had to do your reading over because I was seeing Scorpio in your reading, okay? I don't know if somebody has some strong Scorpio in their chart who that reading was meant for. Um, But I was seeing Scorpio instead of Cancer. I was upset because that one, that one needed to get out. So let's see if it comes out the same. Okay, the the cancer reading that I had was there was a Gemini that wanted to be with a, a cancer. The cancer was married or, or um, had a spouse, husband or wife. This Gemini, Sag, I think they had Gemini, Sag in their chart. And what else? Darn, it was something else they had in their chart, this Gemini. It was a Taurus. Gemini, Taurus, and Sag they had in their chart. So this cancer, um, this this Gemini is from the cancer's past, a soulmate from the cancer's past. So this Gemini is wanting this cancer to leave their spouse. So they could be the empress. Okay, so that's what the reading was about. And also, um, the cancer... Is feeding into the Gemini. It's like they get attention. They love attention from this Gemini person, this Gemini Taurus Sagittarian person. So they keep in touch. So they love to get the attention from the person, and the Gemini is holding on to the Cancer because the Cancer is doing things for this Gemini, like stability wise, giving money, you know. So that's why this Gemini is holding on to the Cancer. And the Cancer is holding on to this Gemini because they love the attention that this Gemini gives to them. Okay. So that's what the reading was about. And this Gemini is trying to rush this Cancer to leave their partner. Okay. And the Cancer is considering it, leaving this, this, uh, this Aquarius. Their partner is an Aquarius. So, you know... They're considering it, okay? And they're in they're going through a struggle. This cancer is going through a struggle because they know they're betraying their partner and it and it's it's burdening them. But they really do want to be with this Gemini. But it's painstaking for them to make the move to do it because they know they're gonna um they're burden, you know, maybe hurt the person or you know. They know they're backstabbing the person. It makes them feel bad, guilty, because they're doing this to their partner behind their back. Okay. So. Okay, they're portraying to be one way to their partner as well. Like, they want to be with them, but they really don't. They really, you know, want to be with this other person. And speaking to this other person and about moving on as well. Okay, so let's see if these cards come out. The same or if a whole nother story comes out. But I wanted to let you guys know what that story was about. And I was saying Scorpio. It could be somebody with strong Scorpio um, in their chart. A cancer with some strong Scorpio in their chart. Okay. So here we go. Let's get some cards to drop. Oh, you guys, check out the description box below as well. And check out the Fitz Benefits website. Okay, if that uh, link down below doesn't work, go to my channel, click on it on my banner, and it will take you straight to that site. Feel free to donate to my channel, like, share, subscribe, new viewers. Thank you for stopping by. All right, all right. Okay, so here we go. Let's get some cards to drop. Oh, and I will be doing free random readings. Um, my email is below. I hope it is. Um, it's it's keep it classy reads. 2021 at gmail.com so hit me up if you want a reading i'll do um i'll be doing romance of a lifetime readings i'll be doing um angel readings which is this one right here i'm just naming it this angel reading and a story read reading okay okay so Cancer's energy. Okay. 
Okay, so we have to have the Ace of Cups. We have the Eight of Cups. We have the Queen of Swords. We have the Six of Cups. And we have the Page of Swords. And we have the Four of Swords. Okay. What's going on? Okay, you're somebody's um you're somebody's fulfillment. Oh, it's coming out the same. All of the same people are in here. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, you're somebody's fulfillment. They're wanting you to walk away from an Aquarius. See? It came out, you guys. It came out again. See? The devil is busy. Okay, it came out again. So the devil was trying to stop me from getting this out. Somebody needs to hear this. So there's somebody that is your fulfillment. I mean, you're somebody's fulfillment. This person wants you to walk away from, what did I say? They want, to, they want you to walk away from a queen of swords. Okay, this person thinks about you all the time. You stay on this person's mind. Constantly, this is a soulmate of yours, somebody from your past. This is somebody from your past. A Gemini, Page of Swords. This person's younger than you. They're petty. They're jealous of um your person. They're jealous because you're with this person. This person is married to you. They want to be with you. Okay, this person is praying that you leave this person, that you walk away. They're praying that they that you and them could be together, okay? This person is very jealous, petty, um, conniving, sneaky, okay? So if you're dealing with Aquarius, if you're tied to a soulmate from your past that is a Gemini, um, this person is, I mean, I'm pretty sure they're telling you what they want you to do already. Claire, um, let's get some more cards. Let me stop right there. The card's saying enough. Cancer's energy. It came out again, you guys. Cancer's energy. So you know somebody needs to see this cancer. You know that somebody. Okay, the Ace of Swords is here. The Page of Wands is here. The Knight of Wands is here. And the Ten of Cups is here. In the four of wands. Okay, so this person is praying that they get this successful new beginning with you. They're praying. Page of wands. Yeah. This person is immature. And they may announce this to you that they want this new beginning off the ground. They may communicate this to you. You, you may speak about this to this person. This person is a player. They're in and out with you. Or this is how you see this person as in and out, a player, you know. Ten of Cups. But you do want a Ten of Cups with this person. Even though you know this person's immature, you know this person's in and out with you, you know this person's a player, 
You still want this Ten of Cups with this person. Four of Wands. Marriage. This person wants to marry you. Fire. They may have fire in their chart as well. Sag Leo Aries. Okay. Um, Cancer's energy. Let's get some more cards. Cancer's energy. Cancer's energy. Yeah, this person may um they may be violent as well. They they may be very defensive. Look at them holding that knife, like I said before. They holding that knife. They ready. They ready for something to pop off. And they're probably meaning it towards this Aquarius. If they find out, this is probably what they're prepared to do. Pop off. And not in a good way. So if somebody's dealing with someone that's dangerous, I would say. Okay, we have this page of pentacles. Okay, that's Earth, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. There you go, you guys. What did I say? Knight of Cups is here. Somebody has some Pisces. The Six of Wands is here. The Four of Cups is here. And the Strength card is here. I told y'all, I don't get playing, man. The devil was trying to mess, mess my reading up so the truth won't get out. Wow. Yeah, this person wants marriage, okay? They want to marry you, Cancer. They want a new beginning of growth. This person wants to offer you love. Six of Wands. They want to charge for in a victory with you. Four of Cups. They want you to offer them a cup. Or they are coming in offering you a cup. Strength, strength card. This person wanna, wants to heal things with you. They're holding on to you. If you guys are going through anything, they want to heal those heal things with you or they want your forgiveness for something or they're going to have some communication with you or you guys are in communication okay so maybe they're offering you something through communication all right so let's go ahead and clarify these cards i'm ready to get deeper into this because this is the same pretty much the same i had last time a few of the cards are different but meaning the same thing clarify the ace of cups Clarify the Ace of Cups and Cancer's energy. Okay, yeah. This person, you're their fulfillment, okay? And they're trying to get insight on how to get you to walk away from this Queen of Swords. They're trying to gain insight. They're trying to look up, trying to figure out all kinds of ways to get you to walk away from this person. You, you, This person feels like you, you balance them out, whichever way that is. Clarify the Eight of Cups. Clarify the Eight of Cups. Okay. So this person is trying to will you. They're trying to manifest that you walk away from this Aquarius. So, yeah. This person may have some Aries in their chart as well. Clarify the Queen of Swords. The Emperor. This is the Emperor. They're trying to will what they want. They go against the grain. If this person is not meant for, for you... They don't care. They want what they want and they're going to do what they can do to get what they want. Okay. Clarify the Queen of Swords. They're going to force it. Clarify the Queen of Swords and Cancer's energy. Okay. Yeah. To get this other chance with you, they're going to will what they want. They're manifesting what they want to get this chance with you again. Okay. Clarify the Six of Cups. Whatever they're going to do. Clarify the Six of Cups. And they think about you a lot. This is a soulmate from your past. They feel bonded to you. They think about you constantly. That could be one of the ways they're trying to will you by constantly keeping you on their mind. Okay? Pulling you towards them. So you stay on their mind. 
clarify. So um, they stay on your mind, okay? Trickery. Clarify the six of cups, okay? Yeah, this person's in love with you, Gemini. Again, they're in love with you. This is a Gemini. Look, they're sneaky, conniving. They're jealous of your relationship that you have with this Aquarius. Okay, they want you to themselves. And like I said, they're ready to pop off. They're probably ready to fight for um what they want. This person is very immature. Petty. They gossip. They probably gossip about whatever you tell them. If you talk about your relationship to this person, they're probably gossiping about it to other people. Clarify the page of swords. Clarify the page of swords and cancer's energy. Clarify the page of swords and cancer's energy. Okay, the Eight of Wands, yeah. This person is ready to move forward with you quickly, okay? Quick. Maybe you've told this person the passion is bond between the per this Aquarius, you and this Aquarius, and they probably gossip about it to other people. But the Eight of Wands, they're ready to move forward quickly. Okay, and they may have communicated this to you. Okay, they're trying to force it verbally first. But if you don't do it, they're going to do something conniving and sneaky to cause it to happen. To cause a tower between you and your person. They're praying. This person is meditating on you. Praying to get what they want with you. Clarify the four swords. Okay, the sun card. This is going to be illuminated to you what this person is doing. Or you make this person happy. Okay, they want they want a successful new beginning, so they're praying for it. Clarify the Ace of Swords. Clarify the Ace of Swords and Cancer's energy. Okay, the the Queen of Pentacles. Stable. This person wants stability with you. Okay. They want to be the privileged lady. They want stability with you. They want to become the privileged lady. Okay. They want you to put this stability in their life. Okay. And they're standing their ground. They're ready to fight for it. Because they believe that you and them should be together. They're standing their ground. Right now, they're holding their composure right now. Okay. Page of Wands is here. But this person is really immature. Okay. You see them holding their composure. But really, this person is very immature. Okay. And it could be like how they communicate to you. What they want, it may come off immature as well. I don't know. You guys may flirt a lot back and forth, communication type. Um, this person may have a lot on their plate. That could be why they want you. Clarify the page of wands. Clarify the page of wands and Cancer's energy. Clarify the page of wands and Cancer's energy. Okay, yeah. The five of cups here. Look at the two women fighting over this one man. Okay, the five of cups, yeah. So this person may now, um, they may feel that you're not interested. They may announce to you or they may speak immaturely to you because they feel like you're not interested in them. And they may try to attack your spouse. Look at this. Because they're upset, they're angry. Because they're feeling like you're not interested in them. So they're going to act out immaturely. Okay? Hmm. This person may want to move in with you. Or move to where you are. To get this Ten of Cups with you. They may be planning on it. Or maybe they're speaking to you about this. Or maybe wanting you to move in with them. To get to have a family with them, 
Seven five the Knight of Wands. Seven five the Knight of Wands. Okay, yeah. Because they want to be your empress. This person probably has Libra in their chart as well. They want to be your... Yeah, they want you to believe your, your spouse. This is your wife or your husband. And this Gemini wants you to leave. So they could be the empress. They want you to move out. Move away from your, your spouse. Okay? So they could be the ten of cups so they could get this ten of cups with you wow clarify this ten of cups i told you guys clarify you can't go wrong when it comes out again clarify the ten of cups and cancer's energy clarify the ten of cups and cancer's energy okay yeah this person wants the will to turn in their favor and get this ten of cups with you all right they're holding on to you this person's holding on because they like that you take care of them, that you spoil them, okay? And that's what they want. They want you to continue to do that so that them being your spouse, taking your spouse place, they can get that, okay? They want to be married to you. Four of Wands. Clarify the Four of Wands and Cancer's Energy. Clarify the four of wands and cancer's energy. Okay, yeah. The six of wands again. They want to charge for it in a victory in marrying, in marriage. This person wants you guys to get married. They want to embark on this new beginning of growth in marriage with you. Okay. Virgo here. So they have Virgo, they have Libra, they have Gemini, Fire. Clarify the page of Pentacles and Cancer's Energy. Okay, the Page of Cups. This person, they want a family with you. Again, you need to use your intuition before you... Um, go any further with this person you need to use your in, um your intuition and this person they may text you and tell you what they want this new beginning to grow with you that they love you knight of cups they may even tell you that they love you because they're going to be offering you love knight of cups clarify the knight of cups clarify the knight of cups in cancer's energy pisces energy clarify the knight of cups Seven of Cups is here, but be careful because Seven of Cups is here. This person is feeding you illusions when they tell you they love you or when they offer you this love. It's not real. It's not real. They just want to get what they want out of you. Okay? To move, charge for Six of Wands in a victory with you. They're going to tell you this to charge for it in a victory with you, and they don't even mean it. Clarify the Six of Wands. Clarify the Six of Wands and Cancer's energy. They're looking to be abundant. They're looking for you to make them abundant. They, they, they believe if they're with you, they're going to be abundant. Abundant. They're going to live a privileged life. Okay? Four of Swords. And they're praying. They're praying that they're able to get this with you. Four of Cups. Okay, they're coming in with an offer. Four cups. Clarify the four cups. Clarify the four cups in Cancer's energy. Or they're waiting for you to offer. Okay? This person, they have a lot of other... They, look, they're waiting. They, they, they feel like you're their fulfillment. They're waiting on you to make an offer to them. They're waiting. They're waiting on your offer. Strength cards. They're waiting on communication of moving forward with them. Clarify the strength. This person's holding on to you. They could have Leo in their chart as well. Clarify the strength. 
Clarify the strand. Okay. Yeah. They're holding on to you because they feel like home with you. Stable, comfortable, secure. Okay. And they're wanting you to cut what you need to cut out your life. So they can have this new beginning with you. This successful new beginning. The Ace of Swords. So Cancer, there you go. This person is um, wanting to be with you. Okay, the other one was more in detail about this person, you know, planning something sneaky. But the page of swords says it all. This person is petty, immature, drama. All right. So there you go. There you have it. And then the other one, they, they were rushing it. But, you know, the eight of wands is there. That's quick. They want to move forward quick. But anyways, um, like, share, you guys. Hit the notification button if you want to be notified when I post a video. Um, join to become a member of my channel. New viewers, subscribe. I'd love to have you guys as a subscriber. Check out the link below in the description box. Fits benefits where? Go to my website if it doesn't work and click on the banner. And it'll take you directly to that site, okay? Um, what else? Oh, feel free to donate to my channel. Um, to, to do what else? Oh, my email is keep it classy reads with an S on the end 2021 at gmail.com. If you want free random readings, I'm doing romance of a lifetime, um, readings. I'm doing angel readings and I'm doing, um, story readings. So you could pick one out of those three and I will do that reading for you. Okay. All right, you guys. Again, hit me up, and I'll do a free random reading for you guys. Love you guys. Be good. And use your intuition, like this is saying, concerning this person. Because this person is drama. You're going to lose everything because of this person. All right? Whoever I'm speaking to. Switch your high resonation, guys. Love you.